Here's a quick video of the enclosure area. So you can see there's uh, only fencing, and you can see how the fence comes in and out at certain areas. So the distance between visitors and the fencing where the chimps are and they sit, it varies from like just over six feet um, down around, this is probably about four feet. Then it juts out a little. That's about five and a half feet, maybe. I don't know. I'm just using an estimation. But when you get over here, it gets even closer, and this is where they sit the most. This is definitely not six feet. A little bit more over here. But the point is, is that people could get up close to them, and if anyone removes their mask or and coughs on them, you know, they're susceptible to what we're susceptible to. Now the path goes in some spaces what looks like, I don't know, what's that, 14 feet maybe? I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? I don't even know how to count the spacing by just looking at it. I'm just using how, how wide I think it is. So it's, yeah, I think it is about 14 feet. I'm going to count it out. But in some spaces, like over here, it's not very wide at all. That's probably six feet, seven if that, and then this little pocket area over here. So I'm not really sure what could be done, but too many people are taking off their mask here, and I think that it makes the chimps too vulnerable when they're sitting right by the fencing. If somebody who is asymptomatic or a carrier in another way, whatever. They don't need to be coughing on the chimps and having particles go into them. Something has to be happening here. We're in week four, so it needs to be changed.